Welcome to SQL Server Tutorial. Today I'm going to introduce you Azure Data Studio. It is a modern cross-platform database management tools. First, log into SQL Server Management Studio for 2019. If you have not installed yet, please view my previous video about installation of SQL Server 2019 and SQL Server Management Studio then run SQL Server Management Studio go to tools here you find the Azure Data Studio I have not installed Azure Data Studio yet so it is automatically redirect me to the download page for Azure Data Studio it is a completely new and free tools to manage SQL Server as like as Management Studio maybe it's better than Management Studio it is a cross-platform tool so you can find installer for Windows, Mac, Linux. I'm gonna download installer for Windows. Here is the downloaded file. Accepting license agreement. And changing the default directory because I have not enough space in C drive. It is not a very big software so it will complete an installation within a few minutes. You can launch as a data studio from SQL Server Management Studio under Tools menu or you can directly launch it from start menu first you have to connect your server name I am using Windows authentication click connect it's uh, almost uh, look like management studio is a database folder security folder or server projects and this one is dashboard it is a new concept actually there are some other tabs dashboard the tax history open editors the editors are opened here also listed here vertically extension marketplace it is a very cool feature you can download and install necessary extension to extend the capability of Azure Data Studio. Now I am going to execute a simple query to explore the functionality of SQL Server Management Studio and Azure Data Studio. First SQL Server Management Studio. To do that you have to click here new query change the default database here is the simple query I am executing it I got the result here I'm going to change order quantity with price to check the autocomplete functionality of SSMS let's do something in Azure Data Studio right click on blank space and select new file paste the query click run to show the result set now I am going to change the query a little bit so both editor has autocomplete feature let's do another test first in SSMS I want to group bar columns and some of the price column. I can do it typing the code here or I can select design query in editor to do it graphically. Right click on editor, add group by and this section select sum and change expire 1 to original column name price
so necessary code is generated by the editor itself Now I got summarized result. Let's do it in the Azure Data Studio. Right clicking on it. But there is no graphical editor in Azure Data Studio. So I have to type everything here to get the result. But it is not the perfect solution. but it can present data as a graph. This is a very new and cool feature in Azure Data Studio. It is not available in SSMS yet. Personally, I like Graphical Query Builder. It is more productive tool than the graph that's all for today if you have any question please comment below and please subscribe to my channel to stay connected